Anyway, Mira, would you like to display the Foul Twins cover on all of our wonderful viewers' screens? Ready? We'll do Three, a fake drum roll. Two, one. You know what? It looks beautiful. So it does. Also, mm -hmm. so it probably doesn't make a lot of sense um, to most people unless you've read um, the prologue in chapter one, mm -hmm. which we have. Yep. But uh, you can, can obviously we talk see about Miles. some of the things in it since it's public knowledge now. Yeah, I, th I think we will because uh, as well there will be a link in the description. Um, I hope. Mm. Leave that bit in mirror. I'll make sure there's a link in the description <laughs> um, to go and actually read the prologue and chapter one, which I do actually have here. Wait, wait, wait. Whee! I highlighted mine. Yeah, I've, I've highlighted. Good. I've highlighted a couple of sections too, and we'll talk about that. But obviously, on the cover, you can see Miles and Beckett. Mm -hmm. um, a couple of interesting things you'll see on. Beckett is wearing a goldfish around his neck. And that used to be his pet goldfish. That Gloop. Gloop. The goldfish <laughs> I've already got it died. Yeah. <laughs> the goldfish died and Miles decided to make it into a tie so Beckett could always have his goldfish near and dear. Sweet and, also... and offensive at the same time. I love it. Mm -hmm. Yep. And initially when I first saw the cover... Um, I, I, because I'd re, I'd read the prologue in the chapter one quite a while ago, and it was sort of hazy in my memory when I first saw the cover. And it's, um, I initially thought that the the things carrying Miles and Beckett were really far away and were probably going to be like LEP shuttles or something. They looked like but UFOs. Actually, yeah, but actually, Mira, do you remember what they're called? Yeah, they're called uh, drobots, actually, and they're a cross between drones and robots. And they're actually child size because they're meant to carry Miles and Beckett. So in the event of an emergency, yes. and with it being an Artemis Fowl based book, is obviously an emergency. Mm -hmm. Also, it's beautiful. The colors are so vibrant, and it and it it sits in tune with the new the new American editions as well. It's kind of in yeah. style and in keeping with them, which I really like. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Just another quick note as well. So this is the, the, the cover that you're looking at now is the US cover. Um, the UK will be getting its own cover, um, mm -hmm. which I'm sure we'll, we'll cover in another episode. Ah, <laughs>